Hi, my name is Mary Spender and you are watching Tuesday Talks. And in this week's episode, I am going to go up north in England to find a not so typical guitar store. Tuesday, 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 Tuesday Talks. You are probably wondering where I am because I'm not where you'd expect and I'm actually in a place called Scan that has loads of different divisions. It has a computer section, it has a video section and it has a pro audio section which is where I am standing right now and I'm here to play Blade guitars. Some of you might know about Blade, they've been around for about 30 years and they are electric guitars made by Gary Levinson, who also makes acoustics, which I will also be playing. But what Scan brought me here to do was to open my eyes a little bit to a make of guitar that I wasn't familiar with and I can say that I'm actually really excited by them. They are very versatile instruments. From my understanding, they were kind of the go-to for session guitarists for a very long time because they are modern takes on classics. So I'm gonna grab some of the models and show you. So this is the RH4 and this is the top range of blade. And this has something pretty sophisticated, but you can see that the trem is flat to the body, but I can actually lower the action as though it's raised and it's called the Falcon Tremolo and it goes both ways and it's like technology that he invented himself and has never sold to anyone so although it's completely flat to the body you can still you can still dive the opposite way so that's very very cool it has a push push system which obviously turns it from a humbucker to a single coil and then it also has the variable spectrum control which makes the five-way switch really versatile because you've got three options per each setting. So three times five, 15 different sounds. It has locking tuners and this particular model has an ebony fretboard. I was also shown by Stu, the tech at SCAN, that obviously you can change the truss rod if you unscrew this little panel and he showed me earlier. This is the RH2, which again has the push-push and the little switches here that change the five-way switch. This is the Texas Pro. So this is obviously different because it's got three single coils, but it still has the variable spectrum control. When I was recording earlier, it kind of took my breath away. This is the Delta Pro, which obviously resembles a Tele. And this is the Dayton Standard, which is slightly different to the others. And it's kind of got like a P90 in the bridge, which sounded great. So those are the main models of Blade guitars, but there are 11 guitars behind me. So I decided that I should just play all of them because some of you might have seen, I have done two videos before where I play 10 guitars in one track but there are 11 here, so I had to turn up one. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy the next few minutes of 11 guitars playing one track. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you. 
If you want to find out more about the guitars that I have played in this video, check out the links in the description. And I'm just super excited to be here because this shop isn't just a guitar shop, it's not just a pro audio shop, it's not just a pro video shop, it's all of those. And obviously including computers and quite advanced technology too, which I may not know anything about, but I'm so willing to be educated and I can't wait to work with them more. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, please subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and comment below if you have heard about Blade and if you have any stories or if you own one, because I'd love to hear more about them from you. But otherwise, I will see you soon.